This is the worst part, you guys. This is the worst part about traveling, leaving the dogs. Come here, Junie. Come here, baby. Oh, my doggies. <laughs> hey, everyone. How you doing? If you are new here, I'm Nicole Concilio, and welcome to the vlog. Oh, my God, you guys. Today, we are traveling to Italy. Thanks to Urban Decay. I am so damn excited. I wanted to do a little intro before I left my house. As you guys know, I'm 100% Italian. I am American, obviously I live in America, but my background is Italian, so I'm so beyond stoked to be going to Italy. I'm gonna take you guys along with me for the travels. We're gonna vlog every experience. I'm so excited, and I'm so excited to be going with Riley as well. The city of love. Oh, I'm so excited. So the car is here right now, so we are heading to LAX. We have a layover in Rome, and then to Naples, and then to the Amalfi Coast. So excited. Let's go. Hey guys, so we finally made it to the Amalfi Coast. I am so excited. We went through three airports. I feel like we've been traveling for like 20 hours, but it is so worth it. It is so beautiful here. I wanted to give you guys a little room tour of what we got going on. So this right here is the bathroom. So pretty. And then this is the main living area with Riley's butt and a nice bed and some fruta. So beautiful. Thank you so much, Urban Decay. Oh my god, I can't believe this. We have a little whirlpool. Look at how beautiful this view is. Oh my gosh. So gorgeous. Wow. Okay guys, so we have just been kind of relaxing in our room. We went to ATM to get some euros. In the town. Yeah, we went in the town and I had a little bit of a problem. I had to call my bank. Yeah, I forgot to do that. If you ever travel internationally, you have to call your banks and your credit cards. But luckily everything worked out. We are going to go to a dinner tonight. The hotel here has been like so amazing, so helpful. I genuinely love talking to all of the workers here. They're so, so sweet. And I can't remember if I told you guys this, but basically Urban Decay sent me here for the Born to Run eyeshadow palette. And I think that this is a really cool way of doing a brand trip because they picked a bunch of influencers and are sending them to different parts of the country and they let us pick where we wanted to go and just parts of the world in general. And it's just so awesome that I had this opportunity because I've always wanted to go to Italy my whole life and to have this is just like a surreal moment for me so thank you Urban Decay I'm so freaking excited for everything tomorrow morning you guys I'm gonna be doing a little look with this I'm gonna show you guys how I do like kind of a day to night look using the palette it is such a beautiful versatile palette I'm gonna show you guys tomorrow but right now we have to meet in the lobby for dinner I'm really excited gonna have some Italian food oh my god okay let's go Okay hey guys, so we made it to dinner. This view right here, I don't know if y'all can see, but it's insanely gorgeous. Oh my God. I, this is like a dream, right Riles? Yeah, it feels fake. <laughs> I know, and the Italians are so nice. They're so nice. Oh, we got some wine coming. It's like a wine, it's right here. Yes, yes. Right thank you. I mean, even the view behind me is so beautiful. I'm so excited we have our plan for tomorrow getting put into motion. Everybody at the hotel is so helpful too and just so sweet. I'll give you guys all the information when I am done with the trip. I'll link everything and tell you guys where we're staying and everything because it's just so beautiful. So right here, we have a fresh tomato. It looks like kind of like a pesto-y olive oil sauce maybe below it. You wanna try it, Riles? I guess I'll try it. <laughs> 
Is it good? <laughs> now we have a mozzarella cheese. Oh my god, I'm gonna die. Oh my god. <laughs> that is the best cheese I've ever had in my life. Oh my god. You go full ball. Oh my god, I'm gonna cry. <laughs> Here is my pasta dish. I got some gnocchis. Here is Riley's. <laughs> Shook it. Go on now, go! Okay, time for the dessert, you guys. I got a apple pie thingy majiggy with some ice cream, and Riley got some flan. Chocolate flan. Coconut ice cream. Coconut. <laughs> he loves his coconuts. Good morning, guys. So last night we had an amazing dinner, and now I'm up really, really early. It's six in the morning, getting ready for the Positano Coast and the city of Amalfi and I'm really excited but I wanted to do like a quick little get ready with me. I'm gonna be using the new Urban Decay products and mixing some other products as well and doing kind of like a light beach day look. So my bathing suit that I'm wearing today is orange and this palette has a, a lot of really pretty warm orange tones. So I'm gonna first go in with the shade Still Shot right there and I'm just going to apply this puppy right in the crease. I'm not sure if I wanna wear foundation today. I may just do like a very natural daytime look. So I'll keep y'all posted. Next, I'm gonna go in with the shade Baja and apply that in my crease, a little bit lower in the crease. This is gonna be a very easy daytime look, y'all. And then on my actual lid, I'm gonna be using the shade Blaze right here. It's a really pretty gold shade, not too dramatic, especially for the daytime and especially for the beach, y'all, because I know it is the summer months now and some of you guys may wanna wear makeup to the beach, get some nice OOTD picks. So this is a really good shade that it's not gonna be like, wow, that girl's wearing makeup on a beach. Okay guys, so we are at breakfast right now. Got a lot of cheese and cake on the plates. He's done already. to the beach it is so beautiful here I'm gonna show you a look we have a bunch of people swimming and then there are the beautiful buildings of Positano All right, so we took a boat to Arienzo Beach, which is more of like a private beach, and they have more like drinks and food and everything here, so we're going to just hang out here. I'm so excited. We have such a pretty view of Positano and just everything in general. I can't wait to go in the water because it's so freaking hot. So we're sitting here having our lunch. Riley got, you got mussels, right? He got mussels and clams, and I got a ravioli. So I'm allergic to shellfish, which really sucks. I mean, it's fine because I don't even really know what it tastes like, so I don't really know what I'm missing, but. Everything, <laughs> everything. But I keep telling people, um, in high school, I took Italian throughout my entire high school career and a year in middle school, and it's like, it's being refreshed right now, like being in Italy. I really, I'm like genuinely thinking about doing a makeup tutorial or something in Italian with subtitles for you guys, of course. But like just kind of like practicing the language a little bit more because it just makes you feel like good when you're able to communicate in a different language. I don't know how to explain it. But I told my waitress today, I was like, 
allergy to shellfish, which in Italian you would say, oh, an allergy on molluschi. And he was like, ah, and I was like, yeah, I know. <laughs> Alright you guys, so now we are shopping in the town of Amalfi and they have a lot of really cute little trinkets and like souvenirs that we are going to get. We are at this local hotspot in Via Tre. Gonna grab some pizza. You ever heard of it? <laughs> there are so many dogs here. I wanna just touch every single one of them. I'm being that crazy dog mom right now. Joe! Joe got Oh! This is the best place ever, okay? We're surrounded by pizza and dogs. Oh my god! I don't know how to like talk to dogs in Italian. Hello, ciao! <laughs> I gotta look it up on Google Translate. Oh my gosh. <laughs> we got our pizza! Whoa! <laughs> I'm so excited to try this. I cannot believe I'm finally having an Italian pizza. I have to document the first bite. Cheers. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. That is the best pizza I've had in my whole life. I just need a little ranch. If I'm being honest, I need a little ranch. It is so good. We have the coolest taxi driver. He just brought us to this really cool bar with all of these humongous wines over there. We got some limoncello. That's so good. Buongiorno. Ciao. Today we are going to Pompeii. We're doing a little pour, pour, tour of Pompeii and Mount Vesuvius, right? I believe? Yeah. So excited. I was looking up on Pinterest, which I know is so like American white girl thing to do. But I was looking up on Pinterest to um, see just like kind of like artsy photos that some people have taken in Pompeii. And I, I got some good ideas, I got some good ideas. We're waiting in the car right now for the bus. It's very, very hot in Italy, but like I, I genuinely love the heat, so I don't mind. I would say we're like more prepared for the heat today because yesterday we were walking around in our like bathing suits and it was just like not a comfortable vibe for me, honestly, but I'm prepared today. <laughs> also, last night when we ate at the pizzeria, I got a message from them and I thought it was like the nicest thing ever. Everybody in Italy, in the Amalfi Coast has been so sweet and just so nice. I got this message from the Vina Vietre Pizzeria and it says, Hi Nicole, today you ate at our pizzeria. We are so glad that you've been at the Vina Vietre Pizzeria and we are so sad because we 
were inside making pizzas and we didn't see you. Only in this moment, a waitress said us about you. We hope you enjoyed our pizza. And they were, they were just so sweet, like, and our taxi driver last night, he took us around everywhere, like to the cool spots and to the bars and he bought us limoncello and I was just like, oh my God, I could get used to this. Like, it's just so sweet. He's a taxi man. He was so sweet. His name is Vincenzo. So yeah, we're just waiting for the bus to take us to Pompeii. It's been such an amazing trip. I'm so incredibly sad that we leave tomorrow. I really, really would love to, in a year, plan a trip to bring my family here. And even like your family, like if we could do like a big family trip, that would be... I know, my, my parents need to be here. They, they're, they're from Italy and have never been. Like it's just so crazy to me. But yeah, I need to plan an excursion once I get money back from my damn mortgage but I'm I'm just so grateful and beyond blessed to be here and thank you Urban Decay for this opportunity so yeah not prepared for a hike. I wore my Gucci shoes like an idiot. <laughs> prepared and I wore the wrong shoes and it was miserable. Look at that. Turn around. But this part is so beautiful too. Ooh. Ah. Uh, Can you piggyback me? No. <laughs> this is gonna be a bitch to get down in my Gucci's. Jump. This is like all rock. Jump. No, 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 no. I would never do that. <laughs> Although I'm like 50% chance in it that you may have to piggyback me if I start slipping. Okay, so we have just made it to Pompeii. Right behind me, Riley's already checking it out. We have an awesome tour guide, so I'm really, really excited. I'm gonna go through here. Everybody's buying tickets still, so right behind me is some of Pompeii. Pretty freaking cool. It is leaving time. Unfortunately, I'm so like, so sad about it. I think this is the saddest I've ever, 
ever been leaving a brand trip or just a trip in general. Italy was literally the most beautiful place I've ever been to in my entire life and I think that that's saying a lot because I've been blessed to be able to go to a lot of amazing countries and amazing places and I'm forever grateful for each and every one of them but Italy just has a special place in my heart and oh my god I just can't believe we're leaving today I was so sad I'm so sad we stayed at the Paradiso Realis in the Amalfi Coast it's right in Vietri or Vietra I think it's Vietri it is so beautiful I totally recommend it the staff was amazing we loved someone named Francesco he was our guy loved him and we also really loved Fabrizio who was the hotel manager he was absolutely amazing and you don't have to be afraid if you don't speak Italian they all speak English like very very well but I would say it's nice to know some words in Italian thank you so much to Urban Decay for this amazing trip we have a layover in Paris which is kind of exciting because I've also never been to Paris so I'm excited to see that airport and everything and also like if they have a Louis Vuitton there we might be in trouble I'm just saying if there's a Louis Vuitton in the airport we may be in trouble but I love you guys so much thank you so much for watching don't forget to subscribe down below hunties and again thank you so much to Urban Decay for this amazing opportunity and I'll see you guys next time bye